Okay, welcome again. <laughs> I had to start. See, Venus is in retrograde. It is so affecting me. I don't know what it is, but it is so affecting me. Okay. All right. I'm hoping that now it is balanced. Welcome. This is the fourth week of October, and we are. Um, this is the um, Scorpions. Um, the Scorpions. You are starting your year 2018. Okay. So, happy birthday to you, Scorpions, um, who are having birthday from the um, the 22nd until the 21st the 22nd until the 21st so um, the 22nd until the 28th so this is for the scorpions who are having birthday from the 22nd until the 28th okay it is so 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 um, it is just so weird I was um, it's just extremely weird with the retrograde that is happening now Venus in retrograde this 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 time this year a lot of people are feeling this so as of the 23rd of October because um, the Librans the Librans are still here so um, from Wednesday because we have the 22nd 23rd so it's Tuesday from Tuesday October 23rd you are moving in the zodiac energy of water the scorpion rules by Pluto so um, for the people on the 22nd of October Monday and Tuesday it's going to be the last energy vibration for you Librans you Librans carry hair but water energy so it's kind of weird um, some of you Librans are going to be start retrograding, going back to the Pluto energy and moving away from the Venus energy because normally you Librans have the energy vibration of Venus, but for you Cups people, because you're Cups people, this is what is happening to you Cups people, okay? Um, the energy of the devil shows up so this year because Venus is in retrograde you have to be extremely extremely careful because your birthday year is um, basically starting with Venus in ret retrograde okay but the most wonderful and the most positive thing about this year for you guys because this is 2018 starting for you guys the most positive thing about this year for you people is that what you're seeing and what is transpiring and I'm trying to do my hair at the same time is that you have the energy of the wheel of fortune I'm on camera like for the beginning for you birthday people because um, then I'm gonna show you the card so this year 2018 is going to be really 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 a year that is going to be out of shift and when I say out of shift, what I'm, I'm, I'm explaining to you is that we have the energy of the Wheel of Fortune, which is very positive. But as we look at the other energy, we have the chariot for um, the Librans. Um, Monday and Tuesday is the energy of the Librans. As we look at Wednesday, the energy of the Scorpion start, and you have your own energy vibration of the Hermit. Um, from Wednesday until Sunday, um, it is a water zodiac energy okay so this year for you guys you guys are all going to be affected by the energies that is coming up okay so we're going to be um, taking a good look and see what is transpiring for the people born on the 22nd until the 28th this is the beginning of your year 2018 something fell out so new love is going to be coming in new love is going to be coming in whatever is happening whatever is transpiring um, some new love is going to be coming in okay so that is one of um, your energies that is coming out so you have the wheel of fortune a lot of you are going to be connecting with past love you have the energy of the wheel of fortune a lot of you are going to be connecting with past love new love is coming for you and this is going to be good so let's go deeper and look at your energy vibration to see what is going to be coming up for the people on the 22nd people on the 23rd people on the 24th people on the 25th 
people on the 26th people on the 27th people on the 28th okay there was some cruelty that has transpired for some of you guys it's as if you're coming out of the energy of all the cruelty and deception that has happened there was really some cruelty that has happened um, to you guys and now you're coming out of this uh, really deception you had to find inner strength it's as if you were going through a seven years uh, situation okay it's as if you guys were going through a seven year situation there was really really some cruelty um, that has um, transpired okay but um, we are going to be looking at that okay so this is a uh, um, wonderful and positive new love is going to be coming in this year so I'm off um, you're gonna be looking at your layout so there we go okay so um, whatever the cruelty that has transpired um, whatever cruelty that has transpired um, the good things is going to be coming out so um, let's see what is transpiring here okay let's see what is transpiring here um, oh, oh, oh. transition and to the sadness so there's some blocks there's some luck coming out with work for some of you guys whatever and whoever was oh there's some luck so after the cruelty some of you have been going through really cruel um, situation in your life um, lies deception and that sort of a thing that was going on in your life some really lies and deception that was going on into your life and now it's coming to an end I know as you guys see this layout you guys are like what um, what is going to be coming up in this year for me remember that this reading is for the people between the ages of 20s but um, the, the reading is for the people who were born 22nd of October until the 28th of October the fourth week okay now it is a year of the wheel of fortune it also comes back in your energy vibration it is a year of the wheel of fortune and it also come back in your energy vibration okay so let's go ahead and look for the people who are born on the 22nd you're a cups person a cups person you're working also duality you have always worked duality in your life the chariot comes um, a situation is going to be ending and you are going to be moving forward now if you were were the, the um, deciding um, to move or to find a new job this is going to be coming out a new love is going to be coming in for you if you're deciding to move find a new job this is going to be happening for you new love is about to come in for you this new love could be coming from someone who is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius um, and some of you could be getting married to this person um, some of you could be receiving a new contract from this person also um, and it's as if this person is coming in for forgiveness you have victoriously triumphant over a situation whoever this person is she's going to be um, reconnecting with you in a very very positive way and acting like um, um, this could be someone offering you work some of you could be getting married to a fire sign person an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius um, whatever the situation is it's going to be positive for you guys but remember Venus is in retrograde um, this um, situation is going to be affecting you in the the rest of the year until your next birthday but it is very positive because you have a yes year this year for you is yes it's fire it's passion um, this is you moving forward does have the energy of Jupiter helping you especially in relationships contract business deals and this sort of a thing so this is good for business people it's a wonderful wonderful year for the business please people because you are going to be connecting with the right people okay so whoever this lady is or was you are going to be realizing um, that this lady could be offering you a new contract okay 
um, because of something that has transpired, okay? She could be asking and offering you a new contract because of something that has transpired. Some of you could be connecting with that lady in a business form. She's going to be coming in. She's going to realize um, a deception situation that has taken place with you. As we move forward, um, we have the energy, and this is a positive energy. Even though it is strength, it is strength against um, some negativity that you have been dealing with. It's strength against some negativity that you have been dealing with. Um, there has been, and these, you know, you're a cups person. And when I said a cups person, you have the energy of the liberants and also the energy of the, the the scorpion and what has been transpiring in your life and this is if you look at this open here it's an art shape that is saying that your angels and guides are protecting you and helping you to move forward there was some situation where people tried to um ruin you lies deception um people tried to ruin you or you tried to do to someone but this year um, after your birthday, you're going to be moving. You're going. To, your position is going to be different. You're going to be moving, and you're going to be um, realizing that your position is different. You're going to be um, transforming yourself into a positive way. So whoever it is, and whoever does this happening to out there, know that you're going to be protected. Okay, there is a protection. Um, twice here because uh, they tried to ruin you but um, things are going to be getting better in this year okay so you have been going through a real hardship and now you're going to be seeing that this is now clearing up the energy of the hermit whenever he comes up in a year like this I've always called it a spiritual year and why is it a spiritual year it's because um, you are going within to find yourself to um, reconnect with yourself and as you reconnect with yourself whatever sadness sadness and disappointment that you have is going to be coming to an end whatever sadness and disappointment you have is going to be coming to an end whatever that has transpired whatever deception and whatever that has to this um, transpire in your life is as if this year you're going to be finding that inner strength to move forward and move forward in a positive way whatever the sadness is it's going to end in this year of 2018 so from now until your next birthday whatever the sadness the indecision um, the distress that has happened it's going to be changing okay here we are we have this energy of the wheel of fortune so congratulations to you scorpion who was born on the 25th the 22nd 23rd 24th 25th congratulations this is the energy vibration of this year expect this year to be a beautiful 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 year some of you are going to be receiving help from the Pisces, Cancer, and Scorpion people. They're going to be bringing you luck in your life. They're going to be bringing you luck in your life. It is as if there was a blockage, but as you notice, um, the positive energy of this card is these people, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion, is going to be coming in to release this blockage from your life, and this is going to be good, okay? A Cancer, Scorpion is going to be coming in to release now these people can come in as friends these come people can come in as business partner whatever the cruelty was it's going to be blocked out and no longer there is some surprise that is going to be coming in for you guys too especially um, the ladies but um, not only the ladies there's going to be some surprise that is coming in for you guys as we move forward and we're looking at the people who were born on the 26th, you have the energy of justice. This is good. So if you were born on the 26th of October and you have have a deceptive situation with your father, with people in power or with your father, people in power or your work uh, lies deception, you're going to be having some luck. Luck is going to be coming for people if you're looking for work. 
new positive situation is going to come in alignment you are going to be moving forward there are going to be prominent people who are going to be helping you but you could be also some of you connecting with prominent re people remember this is a general reading if you would like to have a birthday reading please visit my website and make a booking for a birthday reading okay you can always find that on my website so just visit my website for a birthday reading okay so this this year is going to be really good because the energy of justice is going to be coming in for you guys especially if you had some um, uh, dishonest people around you at work and that sort of a thing um, you're going to be coming out over this thing and you're going to be seeing this thing happening that some luck is going to be coming uh, for you in your business or in whatever work situation is is okay um, it could be with um, um, powerful people um, that um, this is going to be whatever the situation is it's going to be resolved you're going to be having powerful people to help you for the people who were born on the 27th, you have the energy of the hangman. Now, the energy of the hangman is where you're going to go within. You're going to start looking at your relationships, start looking at yourself, start understanding who you are, start aligning with positive energies, start understanding what has transpired, start realizing um, to stand up for yourself. Okay, start realizing to stand up for yourself, no matter what it is. Because obviously, some of you need to stand up for yourself. Some of you scorpions need to stand up for yourself, no matter what it is. Because what we're seeing here is that um, you're going to be learning um, by looking within and learning to stand up for yourself because there was an injustice situation that has taken place. If you notice, both these energy are in reverse. And in this year, 2018, for the people that was born on the 27th, you're going to learn. You have to learn to bring this in control, to stand up for yourself and find the inner power to move yourself on because they're all in reverse. So it's as if you're going in words to find out uh, how can I learn to stand up for myself so that people do not walk over me and make my point about a situation so it's about you all learning um, the energy of the hermit and you find an inner strength to learn to stand up um, to injustice and equality okay learning to stand up to injustice and equality now as we see the people who were born on the 23rd of October the 28th of October um, we are seeing a transition a transition is coming in so whatever sadness dishonesty um, dishonest things that has a, a transpired against you a transition is coming in and a transition is going to be helping uh, um, having a start for your financial situation a fit your financial situation and your emotion your emotion you're going to be um, there's an a, a transformation of your emotion and your financial world is going to be coming in okay so here you see and here you're understanding what has taken place what has transpired is that you're coming out of a very 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 um, dishonest um, horrible um, place where you were fighting um, to get out of some sadness some dishonest things that has transpire with you and you have a transition that is coming in the transition is going to have to do with your financial stability and also the energy of your um, your financial stability but also your emotion is going to be there is going to be um, and and change in your emotion so this is good this is a good year because the wheel of fortune is coming in which is going to be helping you because you're coming out of a very horrible period in your life there was deception there was uh, dishonesty and justice came against this whatever deception is and dishonesty because it was a cruelty of something that has transpired against you and you have the energy of justice coming in some luck is going to be here for you guys new love is going to be coming in the ace of cups is here some of you could be finding out that you are pregnant or you're going to be having a grandchild in this year or um 
or um, you know you're gonna be adopting it's good to adopt this is wonderful it's good to adopt kids if you have the time it's good to adopt kids because um, some new love is going to be coming in your life is going to be transformed whatever low or negative energies whatever lies and deception that was there um, some luck is going to be coming in work um, and um, with your business whatever is transpiring some really positive energies are going to be coming in um, let's see what other energy is happening um, for uh, the people who are having birthdays from the 22nd until the 28th a change in the wind so this is a year with changes that is coming in this is a year of changes and you can see all these changes coming in a change with the wind so whatever that has to inspire what is happening this year is going to be a change within the wind please remember to go and listen to the general reading it's a general libra and scorpion reading for this week it's a fourth week this is your birthday reading but also listen to rest of the reading because you will receive information please like share these videos thumbs up cross watch cross watch is a very 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 important as you cross watch these are very very important so as you cross watch you will receive more information please leave a message um, don't forget um, the moon energies are here so please download them and then um, you will um, be aligned with the energy namaste until next time yeah.